Well, I'm Bharat Acharya. Welcome to our new video. Now, in today's video, we're going to learn parts of two. Anybody learning microprocessors or microcontrollers or uh, computer organization or dig any digital subject has this thing all the time. In our subject, everything is a power of two. Okay, everything is in binary. So every number eventually is some power of two or thereabouts. So instead of being confused all the time, what is kilo, what is mega, what is giga, what is 2 raised to 32, give me 5 minutes, 5 minutes, that's it, is all I want and you'll be damn clear about every power of 2 ever required while learning the subject. Okay, let's start. So let's look at the basic powers, 2 raised to 0 is 1, 2 raised to 1 is 2, 2 raised to 2 is 4, just keep multiplying by 2, it's not rocket science, 2 raised to 3 is 8, 2 raised to 4 is 16, 32, 64, 70, 2 raised to 7 is 128, 256, 512, 1. Okay, 2 raised to 9 is 512, 2 raised to 10 obviously is 1024, 1024 in our subject is called 1K, a kilo, a kilo in microprocessors or in computers is not exactly a thousand, it is 2 to the power 10 that is 1024, are you so far clear? Now, look at these and if I ask you any power of 2, you should be able to answer. If you want, take a look. If you want, try to answer it from your mind. That'll be better. That'll be better. 2 raised to 5, 32. 2 raised to 7, 128. Try not to look. Come on, don't cheat. 2 raised to 3, 8. 2 raised to 4, 16. 2 raised to 6, 64. 2 raised to 7, 128. 2 raised to 2, 4. 2 raised to 8, 256. 2 raised to 9, 512, 2 raised to 10, 1K, 2 raised to 11, hmm. 2 raised to 11, now you don't have to think over it, all over it again, 2 raised to 11 can be derived as 2 raised to 1 into 2 raised to 10, 2 raised to 1 is 2, 2 raised to 10 is 1K, 2 raised to 1 is 2, 2 raised to 10 is 1K, so this becomes 2K, please tell me, did you understand? So 2 raised to 11 is 2K, 2 raised to 12 is 4K, 2 raised to 13, 8K, 2 raised to 16. If you learned a little bit of microprocessors here and there, you will now start coming across numbers that you have been seeing in the books all the time. 2 raised to 16 is 64K, come on it is not rocket science, you just have to tell me a K next to all these numbers, Okay, it is not that difficult. 2 raised to 18, 256K. 2 raised to 19, 512K, 2 raised to 20, 1K, K, a kilo into a kilo is a mega, 1000 into 1000 becomes million, so 2 raised to 20 is 2 raised to 10 into 2 raised to 10, that is a kilo multiplied by a kilo, that is a mega, so 2 raised to 20 is 1M, you ever hear 1 megapixel or 1 megabyte? understand in our subject that simply means 2 raised to 20. Are you clear? So now what is 2 raised to 24? Come on now don't make a big mistake please. 2 raised to 24, 16 mega good. 2 raised to 26, 64 mega, 64 MB if you want to say it that way. 2 raised to 28, 256 mega. 2 raised to 29, 512 mega. 2 raised to 30, 2 raised to 30 is 2 raised to 10 multiplied by 2 raised to 20, 2 raised to 10 is a kilo. Every time you hit a kilo, you go to the next level, okay, on every time you reach 1000, you go to the next level. So 2 raised to 30 is a kilo into a mega, a kilo into a mega becomes a giga. So 2 raised to 30 is a giga. So when I say I have 4 GB RAM, what does that mean, 4 giga, 4 is 2 raised to 2. Giga is 2 raised to 30. That means it is 2 raised to 32. Are you clear? When I say 2 raised to 36, come on, now give me a correct answer, make me happy. 2 raised to 36 is 2 raised to 6 multiplied by 2 raised to 30. 2 raised to 6 is 64. 2 raised to 30 is a giga. 64 G. Are you clear? In case your phone has 64 GB memory, my phone, uh, 256 GB memory. Come on, 256 GB memory. Break it down for me. 256 is 2 raised to 8, G is 2 raised to 30, 
that means 2 raised to 38. So if you learn this thing in our subject, it will be written as 2 raised to 38. 2 raised to 38 for the layman, for the normal people around us, that's 64, 256 uh, GB. 2 raised to 29, 512 GB. 2 raised to 39, sorry. 2 raised to 40. 2 raised to 40 is 2 raised to 10 multiplied by 2 raised to 30. 2 raised to 10 is a kilo. I told you every time you hit a kilo, you go to the next level. So it's a kilo multiplied by a giga becomes a tera. So 2 raised to 40 is a tera. Of course, it goes much more than this. There is no limit to numbers, they go up to infinity. But this is what a person needs to know while learning these subjects. These are real world numbers. You What's the size of your hard disk? Most of us use a hard disk of, you know, the, oh, come on. <laughs> Most of us use a hard disk of around 1 TB at home. So when somebody asks you in oral exams, which we call VIVAS in Bombay University. Most universities in India, they call they use that word. Anyway, so uh, examiner says, what's the size of your hard disk? They say, uh, student says it's uh, 1 TB. Examiner says my hard disk is 2 raised to 40. Whose is bigger? It's the same. They're just trying to confuse you. These are all numbers which are powers of 2. Okay. So just wanted you to know that. What is 2 raised to? Now I'm, I'm going to ask you 4 questions. 1, 2, 3, 4. Try to get all the 4 right and I'll be super happy. What is 2 raised to 43? 8 tera. Excellent. What is 2 raised to 36? 64 giga. Nice. What is 2 raised to 25? 25, 32 mega, excellent. What is 2 raised to 14? 16 kilos. Nice, nice. And 2 raised to, yeah, so now you got your pass. I just wanted you to know, you will come up. You may be thinking it was so uh, basic. It is, of course, it is basic. the basics of the subject. Well, the more you learn the subject, the more you'll remember this uh, uh, small video that we had of uh, this powers of 2 because you'll need it all the time. Every answer of the subject, microprocessors, has something to do with some power of 2. So instead of being confused all the time, learn it once for all. I hope you got it. That's it. Thank you. Now, I am in the process of making videos for this subject. Uh, I've been... Uh, working around the clock doing it as much as I can. Uh, I've putting up or been putting up all these videos on my own website. It's called www.bharataacharyaeducation.com. It's the same name. That is the name of this channel. Okay. So uh, if you want to watch all the videos and learn the entire subject, all you need to do is go log on to that website, create your own login ID like you create everywhere in every social media site. Uh, it's a paid site. Because all of this requires a lot of effort. It's but I've kept trying to keep the amount as low as possible. Subscriptions start from 4.99. Then there are better uh, uh, packages which uh, are a little more expensive but give you more, more and more features. We are we are constantly working on that. So we go, going to add many more features as and when we can. But anyway, anyway. So the subscriptions have started. People are people are watching that website. So. Uh, you're most welcome if you want to learn the whole subject. Uh, check out the website. Also, my book is available now. Earlier it used to be on Amazon. I've uh, removed it from there. My book is now on my website. All you need to do is again the same thing. The price of the book I've kept it as good as possible. Include shipment uh, about 500, 599 as of now. It uh, as of now as with the new increase in rates everywhere. Anyway, so uh, the physical deliveries of the book are only in India. Uh, so all you need to do is. Again, log in, give your full address, make a payment. The book will be dispatched on the very next day. And generally, it reaches even far from places within three to four, max six working days. We say that just for the safety's sake. Generally, it's less than that. Okay? Wish you all the best. Do well.